One day an experienced diver who survived a shark attack in the Bahamas last week spoke on Today Monday about the harrowing moment when he realized the shark had struck him from behind. Jonathan Hernandez, a professional boat captain and fisherman from Florida, was spearfishing with friends off Abaco Island when he found himself in mortal danger from a shark bite. He got hit so hard from behind he thought the boat had run me over, he told NBC's Carrie Sanders in an exclusive interview. I immediately looked to the left side and the shark was right in my face. Hernandez was bitten on the left calf, but was able to swim to safety. I was able to get away, kicking away, he said. I looked in the water, and I could see in the water that my calf was hanging and gushing blood into the water. It all happened so fast it was kind of a blur of white water and fins and thrashing. Hernandez had his friends quickly make a tourniquet for his calf out of weight belts used for diving. The fact that the tourniquet went on between 60 and 90 seconds of the actual attack was probably the single biggest factor and why I'm sitting here talking to you today, he said. Hernandez told Sanders it will be six weeks before he can begin physical therapy on his shredded left calf.